all right guys this is nifty and daily chart as we discussed yesterday we was looking for buy uh, just a minute okay after breaking this resistance line so somewhere here i can see this is the resistance line somewhere there and i can see this is the strong resistance this is the resistance the resistance and the resistance so finally you can see price broke this resistance line and let me show you one thing here in a small time frame i was looking for buy after breaking this level uh, 15,370. So let's see in small time frame. Where is my entry point? Uh, now I can see here. Okay, let me show you one thing. Why I was looking for buy. This is the daily chart. Now I can see uh, CCI. This is the uh, CCI uh, 300 period. So most of the people are thinking why I'm taking uh, this CCI means if cci stay above 100 or stay above zero level so let's see let me remove this one so if cci stay above zero level means trend is up if cci stay above positive 100 means strong uptrend is it clear strong uptrend if cci stay below uh, zero line means it's a downtrend if stay below negative 100 negative 100 so cci stay like positive 100 zero level and negative 100 all right so if stay below this one strongly downtrend now here i can see cci last a few days or not exactly few days few months she says stay uh, she says running above positive 100 here i can see this one positive 100 means strong uptrend all right now another here you can see another indicator here you can see i'm using moving averages now you can see all moving averages are arranging sequently here you can see 200 150 100 uh, like a 50 sorry 50 like 20 all moving average are arranging sequently means trend is clear uptrend how we identify by using moving average uptrend and that uptrend strength is indicating by cci remember means clear uptrend now when i'm applying another indicator here you can see this one called rsi now I'm using RSI to identify my entry point. When trend is up, how how I identify trend is up by using moving average and CCI. And I am I'm using RSI to identify my entry point when RSI are bouncing 40 or it's cross 40. Uh, sorry, 60. So that is two entry point. Now somewhere here we have seen this is our entry point buy entry somewhere there buy and uh, not exactly here buy entry somewhere there buy entry somewhere there and another buy entry we have seen somewhere here all right so that is our buy entry okay now let's see in a small time frame let's just jump to 15 minutes okay here i can see that is our resistance line here on the next day so you can see yesterday price opened a gap up so there are no buy opportunity finally you can see price drop to this level 60 that is our buy opportunity and another here you can see price uh, broke this uh, 60 level finally they broke a cross 60 line somewhere here somewhere here today that is our buy opportunity why we are looking for buy because trend is clear up by using moving average and it's just showing the strength of this uptrend by using cci that is our, our perfect buy opportunity all right so similarly we are looking for buy after giving a correction uh this rsi may be somewhere near 40 level or somewhere near 60 level so we are looking for buy here 
all right so let's see today a top gainer stock reliance icici jsw so let's jump to first uh, reliance let me click on here okay reliance all right okay now see daily chart first all right and I can see this uh, CCI was above zero line means a little more uh, strength. All right, if price stay, CCI stay above 100 is a very strong uptrend. Now, how are we identify uptrend by moving average? Here I can see 200 moving average just, uh, just below and above is 150. 100 all are like that. They are arranging and here, price was running in a sideway and finally 200 act as a support and the CCI are above zero line zero line are somewhere there and here I can see a reliance cross somewhere here but another buy opportunity we have seen somewhere there they're bouncing off bouncing off somewhere there and the next buy opportunity we have seen somewhere there all right so if you're not seeing a small time frame like uh, 15 minutes for intraday trader, I can see this is the clear crossover by opportunity somewhere there. Here I can see CCI cross, RSI cross, that is our buy, perfect buy opportunity. All right, so later another video I'll create how to use this indicator. Another ICICI, let's jump to ICICI bank. All right, uh, this is 15 minute uh, yeah, daily chart. Now I can see CCI clear, uh, no, not CCI, first trend. Uh, this is moving average 200, 150, 100, all are arranging sequently. Means trend is clear uptrend. All right, now let's jump to small time frame uh, to identify our entry point. But who people are looking for uh, buy and they want to hold their position for the long term or you can apply in this strategy uh, for swing trading and I can see that is a perfect buy opportunity somewhere there all right okay now let's uh, jump to small time frame like 15 minutes to identify entry point here I can see they are bouncing off 60 that that is our buy opportunity bouncing of 60 that is our buy opportunity this is the crossover perfect buy because trend is up so we are looking for buy only another somewhere here buy opportunity now most of the people are looking for buy don't do that you just wait for a pullback rsi will be somewhere there here above 60 or above 40 that will be our buy opportunity another just uh, i think this is w still still all right now let's let me show you daily first now I can see here so RSI still above uh, zero level all right now it's a positive uh, somewhere positive 200 means strong uptrend how we identify uptrend uh, this is uh, moving averages have you seen this moving averages are are telling us that this JSW still is strong uptrend. Uh, here I can see CCI con uh, confirming us is a strong uptrend, but here I can see um, this one called RSI, but still we have not seen any buy opportunity. We are looking for a crossover. So let me show you exactly. Once price cross this 60 level, exactly that will be buy opportunity. Price will be somewhere there. It's okay. All right, as an intraday, let me show you. Let's just jump to 15 minute. Basically, I use 15 minute chart. Here I can see clear uptrend and the uh, moving average just crossing here. And if you want to see the price action method, they are creating higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, and the higher high, higher low, higher high. Now, where we have seen crossover somewhere there. Have you seen this one crossover? 
and perfectly they cross this 200 exponential moving average and at that time cci in a small time frame i am not talking daily the uptrend small time frame for temporarily this is that was a downtrend and finally here you can see they place a uptrend so that is our perfect buy opportunity this is a perfect uh, anti setup all right so basically we are using this one uh, for intraday and swing trading so this is our buy opportunity so next we need a pullback and at that time rsi will take a support near 60 or near 40 that will be our buy opportunity or if price cross that one so that will be our buy opportunity very clear remember so another one let me show you i see i see as is okay dr reddy lab okay where baby dr reddy yeah dr uh, reddy Dr. Reddy Laboratory. Okay, this is 15 minutes. Let's see first the daily. Is it an uptrend or downtrend? Click on there. Now you can see this is the clear uptrend. How we identify is it a clear uptrend by moving by using moving averages. Have you seen this one? Moving average clearly arranging. Alright. Uh, below 200, above uh, 150, above uh, 100. Uh, above 50 above uh, 20 whatever so all are arranging frequently means that uh, uptrend now is it uptrend strong uptrend or weak uptrend it's identified by cci 300 period now you can see cci are confirming their uh, strong uptrend now let's just jump in a small time frame to enter all right now let's see in a 15 uh, minute in a small time frame 15 minutes they are running in a downtrend but price action method and finally they broke this uh, 200 price action method here you can see uh, clear, uh, uh, creating a new high low higher high higher low higher high so finally we have seen breakout and at that time they cross 60 at that time they cross zero line this is the far pack buy opportunity remember so why i never reveal this uh, strategy first time i'm giving this strategy so let's see another stock okay uh word about the airtel all right let's jump to party airtel okay this one all right let's jump to first the daily okay price are uh, supporting level zero have you seen this one price not able to break this zero line uptrend uh, now you can see according the moving average here i can see 200 moving average are somewhere there above 150 above 100 all right above uh, 50 moving average all are ranging but uh, in this area we have seen temporarily uh, downtrend in a small time frame like uh, 20 cross uh, 15 inch temporary downtrend but major trend is up all right so and even here you can see that the cci are not able to break this zero line here have you seen this one zero line price was stay price was staying above this zero line means still they are running an uptrend all right but the uptrend trend is very low not very strong all right and uh, rsi us taking support near 40 level have you seen so some people are using 40 50 30 whatever so basically you can use this one also now finally we have seen this is the bullish candle sticker and not exactly that one this one first one bullish candle and we you can place buy order a little more above that bullish candle so similarly here you can see we place buy order a little more above that bullish but not able to trigger our buy order next candle they form bullish and today here you can see triggered our buy order and uh, uh, price gone up a little more high but if you are a, a, a intraday trader now let's see according the price action they are creating higher high higher low higher high higher low and today price open a gap up and break this level and at that time here you can see rsi cross 60 cci was just below that one 
but uh, this, that is not confirmation so later here you can see we have seen another buy opportunity somewhere there they are taking support near 60 level and they cross uh, zero level and that is our buy opportunity so we are expecting the price will create a new high very soon so let's see last one uh, okay last one tata steel let's jump to tata steel steel tata steel okay what happened tata steel okay all right now see you know the uh, daily time frame is it a uptrend or downtrend now you can see here clear uptrend all moving average are ending uh, sequently have you seen okay okay now have you seen it's a clear uptrend all moving average are ending sequently next see the uptrend strength uh, CCI above uh, 100 means uh, already they are running 187 CCI means uh, trend is very strong which trend uptrend is very strong so we are looking for buy now let's jump to small time frame to enter in this market now I can see here somewhere there all right so here I can see all right here I can see crossover somewhere there breakout here zero level breakout 60 level breakout perfect buy opportunity all right so I hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching